Protecting customer and business data is critical for safeguarding competitive edge, brand reputation, customer loyalty, as well as fraud reduction and regulatory compliance. As businesses of all sizes collect data from their customers and big data from a variety of sources, they must preserve consumer privacy and prevent identity theft. Regulations such as European Union's GDPR and California's CCPA have strict requirements around how companies collect, process and store personal data, and the U.S. Federal Red Flags Rule requires companies to prevent identity fraud by managing identity theft red flags. With the advent of artificial intelligence and machine learning in big data collection and analysis, there is no shortage of target and incentive for data thieves who can profit enormously from valuable data that companies own. Thus data breach is a serious and rising threat which must be considered by risk-aware organizations globally. Just to highlight the consequences of data breach, the average data breach costs over $4 million and 80% of global companies have experienced at least one data breach incident. These costs can be attributed to investigation efforts, implementation of additional security measures, lawsuits, and penalties by government agencies. Let's explore how top companies protect data and learn from them. 1. Hire and retain an adequate level of qualified data security staff who can develop policies and procedures, perform security risk assessments and audits, and implement solutions. The staff can help organizations develop data flow and security diagrams to quickly know what type of data is stored where and how it is protected. 2. Create policies and procedures to consistently apply data protection practices across the organization. This is especially important for changing risk environments such as companies that switch to remote work and allow bring your own device for accessing systems and business data. 3. Educate your user community regularly about your data protection policies and best ways to protect systems, data, and access credentials. Some users may have more privileged access than others and must be educated in a focused group and held accountable. 4. Don't trust any user or any device by applying a zero-trust policy because any compromised person or device can negatively affect the security of other systems. Also, apply the principle of least privilege to ensure that users do not have more access than they need to perform their job. 5. Encrypt sensitive data whether data is in transit or storage. This will render the data useless and prevent misuse of intercepted or compromised data in case of a data breach incident. 6. Budget appropriately to balance the cost of securing business data with the rewards of preventing data breach incidents. To learn more about various data protection concepts, join Identity Management Institute and register for the Certified in Data Protection Training and Certification Program. Visit our website to learn more.